Hello, my friends, and welcome back to another Home City Families Playgroup. We're so happy you're tuning in again this week. This week, if you saw our curriculum for the week, it's all about the ocean and friendship. So we're going to be tying in with our book here, Rainbow Fish. You'll see some props behind me. And Cinnamon, you have some stuff too there. What do you have? I have a rainbow of fish. Ah! <laughs> ha ha ha. Multi I like that. Here, you know, and um, they're just hanging out because they really can't wait to hear the story. They don't even know the story Rainbow Fish yet. <laughs> oh, they're going to learn it. They're going to love it. They're going to learn a lesson from it too, I hope, just like all of you. But anyways, let's dive right into it. So are we ready to get started with the welcome song? Go ahead, Linda, kick us off. All righty, guys, here we go. Hands in your lap. Hello, friends. Hello friends, hello friends, we're glad you came to play. Hello everyone. Hello friends, that was fantastic. Does anybody remember what comes next? Oh, Cinnamon, I think you know. Yes ma'am. So it's you. We're going to talk about the days of the week, the calendar and the weather, all right? So everybody sing along with me. Ready? There's Sunday and there's Monday, there's Tuesday and there's Wednesday, there's Thursday and there's Friday, but then there's Saturday, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week. All right, my friends, so it's the first day of the work week where we meet each other again, and that day would be Monday. Today is Monday. And Jen, by chance? Do you have any idea what month we're chilling in? It is May. Awesome. We are in the month of May. Yes. And Lynn Lynn, Miss Linda, how many days have we been in the month of May? We have been in the month of May for 18 days. Yeah, it's tough to keep track, but yes, 18 days. Yes. <laughs> We've been in the month of May. And Megan, can you remind my friends what year it is? That is 2020. Absolutely, absolutely. So together, my friends, today is Monday, May 18th, 2020. And so I'm looking out my window and I say, what is the weather, the weather, the weather? What is the weather out today? Well, you know, we had such a good day yesterday that today possibly couldn't be as great. So, you know, since the sun needs a break, I'm going to call it Cloudy. Meteorologist Nick Bannon says, he says it's cloudy too. <laughs> so there we go, my friends. That concludes the calendar and the weather. Thank you, Cinnamon. It's definitely cloudy here. But it makes me still a little bit warm, so that's the good news. All right. Next, we have to get our singing voices ready. With Miss Jen, take us to the songs. All right, hello everybody. Megan's got us ready here. So Megan, do you want to pick the first song for us today? I first, yes, I want Row, Row, Row Your Boat. Okay, we're gonna do Row, Row, Row Your Boat. Everybody get in your boats, get your oars ready, and we'll do a quick Row, Row, Row Your Boat. All right, Row, Row, Row Your Boat, gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. Do you guys want to do something a little different this time? Do you want to go really fast? All right, let's go really fast. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 and life is but a dream. How about one more time, but we can go really, really slow. All right. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. All right, good job, everyone. All right. Hey, Linda, would you like to pick the next one? Yes, please. I'd like to pick the speckled frogs. All right. You got some frogs, speckled frogs. See those yellow spots on that frog? All right, we're going to use three frogs today, okay? So we're going to have Three green and speckled frogs sitting on a hollow log, eating the most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. 
One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Then there were two green speckled frogs. Two green and speckled frogs sitting on a hollow log, eating the most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Then there was one green speckled frog. One green and speckled frog sitting on a hollow log, eating the most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. He jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there were no green speckled frogs. Oh, all right, thank you guys, nice work. And we have one last one, it's a classic. We do it all the time because everybody loves it. Cinnamon, do you know what that one is? Let's see. Yes, Teddy. It's the ABCs. Thank you, Cinnamon and Teddy, the ABCs. All right, ready? A, B, C, D, E, F, G. H I J K L M N O P Q R S T U V W X Y and Z. Now I know my ABCs. Next time, won't you sing with me? Great job! Wow, great job, everybody. We really know our ABCs. We've been practicing a lot, my friends. Great job. So, what's next? Tell you what's next. Book time. Look at the size of this book, my friends. Look at it, it's bigger than me. So that means you're gonna be able to see it really good. This is the story about the rainbow fish. Look at that sparkly little fish there. This book has seen a lot of love, my friends. <laughs> and I don't have cinnamon here to help me hold this, so best of luck to me. <laughs> here we go. The rainbow fish. A long way out in the deep blue sea, there lived a fish. Not just an ordinary fish, but the most beautiful fish in the entire ocean. His scales were every shade of blue and green and purple with sparkling silver scales. Wow. The other fish were amazed at his beauty. They called him Rainbow Fish. Come on, Rainbow Fish, they would call. Come and play with us. But the Rainbow Fish would just glide past, proud and silent, letting his scales shimmer. One day, a little blue fish followed after him. Rainbow Fish! Wait for me, please give me one of your shiny scales. They are so wonderful and you have so many. I don't know if Rainbow Fish is gonna give one, let's see. You want me to give you one of my special scales? Who do you think you are? Cried the Rainbow Fish, get away from me. Shocked, the little blue fish swam away. He was so upset, he told all his friends what had happened. From then on, no one would have anything to do with the rainbow fish. They turned away when he swam by. It wasn't very nice of him. Oh no. What good were the dazzling shimmering scales with no one to admire them? Now he was the loneliest fish in the entire ocean. One day he poured out his troubles to the starfish. I really am beautiful. Why doesn't anybody like me? I can't answer that for you, said the starfish. But if you go beyond the coral reef to a deep cave, you will find the wise octopus. Maybe she can help you. Hmm. The rainbow fish found the cave. It was very dark inside and he couldn't see anything. Then suddenly, two eyes caught him in their glare and the octopus emerged from the darkness. I have been waiting for you, said the octopus with a deep voice. The waves have told me your story. This is my advice. Give a glittering scale to each of the other fish. You will no longer be the most beautiful fish in the sea, but you will discover how to be happy. Hmm. I can't, the rainbow fish started to say, but the octopus had already disappeared into a dark cloud of ink. Give away my scales, my beautiful shining scales? Never! How could I ever be happy without them? Hmm. Suddenly he felt a, a light touch of a fin. 
The little blue fish was back. Rainbow fish, please don't be angry. I just want one little scale. The rainbow fish wavered. Only one very, very small shimmery scale, he thought. Well, maybe I wouldn't miss just one. Do you guys think he's gonna give up one of his scales? Carefully, the rainbow, fish, the rainbow fish pulled out the smallest scale and gave it to the little fish. Thank you, thank you very much. The little fish bubbled playfully as he tucked the shiny scale in among his blue ones. A rather peculiar feeling came over the rainbow fish. For a long time, he watched the little blue fish swim back and forth with his new scale glittering in the water. He decided to share. The little blue fish whizzed through the ocean with his scale flashing. So it didn't take long before the rainbow fish was surrounded by the other fish. Everyone wanted a glittering scale. The rainbow fish shared his scales left and right. And the more he gave away, the more delighted he became. When the water around him filled with glimmering scales, he at last felt at home among other fish. Can you guys see everybody has a scale now? Ah, uh, finally, the rainbow fish had only one shining scale left. His most prized possession had been given away, yet he was very happy. Come on, rainbow fish, they called. Come and play with us. Here I come, said the rainbow fish, and happy as a splash, he swam off to join his friends. The end. That's the end of the story of the rainbow fish, my friends. Cinnamon, can you tell me what that story, what was the lesson there in that story? Well, I heard sharing. Sharing. sharing like a really good lesson in the story. Yep, so that's a good friend shares. What else do good friends do? Yes, Linda. They're nice to their friends. Ah, they're nice to their friends. They share, they listen, they might give their friends a hug. That's right, my friends. That's what it means to be a good friend, okay? So that's the end of our story. I want to keep you updated on my butterflies, okay? Or my caterpillars, I should say. So I had ordered some caterpillars and maybe you have or haven't seen them yet, but look at them now. <gasps> what is going on here, my friends? Jen, what do you see? I see those caterpillars hanging from that container and they are, are they starting to make their chrysalises so they can? One of them is, can you see the one right up there is starting yes. to, the other ones are getting ready. And what happens after that? <gasps> They're gonna become butterflies. So keep posted every week. Maybe by next week they'll have turned into butterflies. I don't know, but Stay tuned and you'll be able to see our butterflies grow. And that's it for Playgroup today, my friends, okay? So I'm gonna close it out with a goodbye song and then we'll see you, can tune into our live Playgroups or we'll see you here next week, okay? Goodbye friends, goodbye friends, goodbye friends, we're glad you came to play. Goodbye my friends, goodbye, Bye, we friends. miss you. Bye.